Uh, today is Wednesday, February 4th, and this is my video diary for the day. Uh, spent the uh, day in Edmonton today, got up early, uh, drove up Highway 2, uh, and uh, on the way had some great uh, great phone calls, uh, met with some really interesting people here today, uh, good discussions about uh, how we can continue to, to build the party, uh, and also uh, some talks with some people who I think are going to make fantastic candidates for us in the upcoming, uh, and I'll say again, unnecessary provincial election. Uh, the issue of the day is the uh, 5% MLA pay cut. Uh, as you know, earlier in the week, uh, Cabinet voted for a 5% pay cut, and we've seen uh, MLAs take a 5% pay cut today. You know, On one level, that seems to make a lot of sense. We think, oh, that's good, you know, we're going to lead by example. But let's not forget that MLA pay since 2008 is up around 20%, so really, it's not much of a cut. Uh, I don't know many people whose pay is up 20% over uh, over that period of time. Uh, but more than that, we've got MLAs on the PC side, especially retiring, and, and those MLAs, some of them have served for more than 20 years. They get a severance uh, of over, in some cases, over $800,000. Now, they're not going to take a 5% reduction or any reduction on that, and that just doesn't feel right to me. Public service, to me, really ought to be about exactly that. It should be about service, not about self-interest, not about how much money you could make. It really is about giving back to your community. So for me, I think a 5% MLA pay cut is, uh, is a bit of a cynical move. Uh, and I, I think it, uh, it isn't showing leadership by example. I think real leadership by example uh, would be a government that, uh, that thinks of uh, a vision for the future of the province. Doesn't just look for ways of uh, hacking and cutting uh, budgets. A government that has an ability to save uh, in the good times. Uh, and uh, that'll allow us to, uh, to to ride out the bad. In a province with a cyclical nature, uh, a cyclical and resource-based economy like Alberta, that just seems like basic good management. And I can tell you for sure we haven't seen that from these guys, uh, from the PC government for many years. So that's my video diary for today. Uh, another day in Edmonton tomorrow and then back to Calgary for some more meetings. Uh, my highlight of my day tomorrow is my daughter's uh, Carnival. Uh, and uh, there, my daughters are in French immersion. We have Carnival tomorrow, so we're going to do Cabana Sucre and uh, lots of interesting stuff tomorrow night. Uh, we'll uh, we'll talk again soon.